Hey fam, oh my goodness. I know it has been a minute since your girl has checked in. I hope you and yours are doing well. Um, even though I've been running around when I told you my August was gonna be busy. Oh my goodness, it was busy, it was productive, but it was like beautifully busy and productive. I was able to do a lot of the things that I wanted to do and that was really great. It's a great time to be alive, amen. <laughs> But I missed you and I will definitely expound on that in my budget goals video that's coming up. And so, yeah, let's get to it. We'll catch up on those other things later, I promise. Okay, so you can see my mortgage tracker. You see where we left off. You can see here August 10th, I made an extra principal payment of $250 on the 30th. I completed my goal of putting an extra $500 to my mortgage principal and boy was that a relief <laughs> that I actually got that done. So I was really happy with that. Heading over to my amortization schedule, I am going to add that $500 in this extra payment. You know how I do. I like to take a look at this extra payment savings as well as this actual number of payments before hitting enter. I'm going to hit enter. All right. You see what we're working with here. You saw the change. Okay. You know, I'm excited about it. Okay. So the ending balance for the month, I'm going to copy that back over to round out the month. Okay, so you see the changes happening here, all right? I'm gonna keep it moving and go ahead and account for September. I'm gonna bring this ending balance over to my beginning balance on this new worksheet. And on the 23rd, I made my mortgage payment Okay, I'm going to account for that on the schedule. And then I'm going to move over my ending balance. Okay, so I'm always going to check this against what my mortgage company has. So I'm going to double check there. And its balance is a bit different. So I'm gonna go with my mortgage company for now. And then I will chase down exactly why there's a difference between the two. My mortgage company has 58 cents more as the ending balance right now. So I am going to update this to 68. And you can see, even though it was nice to see that 3% to that goal of 5%, 2.99%, I'll take that as well. Yes. So I'm really happy with this, happy with my progress with this major goal within the year. And for my financial health and wealth, I hope you are happy with your progress as well, whether that's paying off the mortgage, whether that's getting to take that vacation you need, whether that's paying down your debt, whether that is keeping afloat, whether that is bouncing back, you know, all the things. I love you. I'll chat with you next time.